What's up guys, I'm Vern. I'm Henry. Welcome to another edition of Poggy Boy Production Channel. Again, it's early in the morning. I think we're here in the Chinatown area, right Henry? Yes. Yeah, you can see the big awning in the back. Mm -hmm. I heard this place is booming with like business, but today we're having breakfast. Have you heard of Baby Stacks Cafe, Henry? Of course not. <laughs> but you're hungry though, right? Definitely. I heard they have a mix of fusion of Filipino and American and all kinds of good stuff. So we're going to go inside and let's eat. You ready? Of course. Let's go. We at Chinatown. Chinatown for breakfast. as always I like to add mine with some cream a little bit of sugar Henry likes to drink his black how do you guys like your coffee comment down below I got the loco moco got some eggs on it the gravy one lonely little orange here uh, some rice in there and there's I'm sure there's a patty in there somewhere here's my ube pancake look at that luscious sweet Purpley, <laughs> sweet. <laughs> Henry got the adobo fried rice, right? Yes, sir. Comes in the omelet. You got some hash brown and orange there. Henry's cutting into it now. Tell me if it tastes like adobo to me. Uh, she a little rice. I haven't tasted the rice. <laughs> I'm trying to go through the rice. Get the small. Yeah. Oh, you broke it. I see a lot of rice though. Yeah. Fuck. I see the, the shredded meat in there. The adobo. Oh, it's there. I see it. Does it taste like your adobo? Not my dumb but, <laughs> but it, it just tastes like a Okay, good. That's all we needed. Loco Moco. Loco Moco. See? <laughs> you loco. I'm a loco. I'm gonna try to get as much as I can. Put everything in. Look at the egg beat. It's very uh, drippy. Oh, you did order sunny side. Yeah. So I got a little bit of egg, a lot of the gravy, and some rice. There you go. Take that big bite. Yeah. Mm. It's good. Mm. It's good. How good? Super good. It's delicious. I've never had Nakumago uh, Hawaiian dish. It's right. It's a Hawaiian dish. Mm. Let me go to Hawaii. <laughs> I want to go to Japan first. Oh, Japan first, yeah. That's our next goal. That's good. Too. Oh yeah, look at that. Brown green beef. Killed it. Killed it. Almost. Almost. Oh, that's a big portion of that. That is a big portion of an omelet. That is a big portion of a. That's a big ass omelet. But. And it did pretty good. I haven't, I, mean, I haven't eaten this much rice since you started. <laughs> yeah. For a long ass time. You want me to eat some hash brown there for you? Yeah, if you want hash brown. <laughs> I'm good. What is this? What kind of. Uh, that's a, like cinnamony, sugary. It's condensed milk. Condensed milk. Are you? Henry, this is really bad for you. 
So soft and gooey, Henry. Oh, this is very luscious. Look at that. Oh, drips. Drip city, right? This is a big bite. <laughs> and it's a bite. Mm. Sweet. Mm. Good. Mm. And very bad for me. <laughs> One bite won't hurt you. That's what they always say, man. <laughs> One bite would never hurt me. <laughs> but for the content, guys, I'm gonna try one bite. Yay! But let me finish my. Yes, I'll help you out. <laughs> that, that's the face that wants it some more, but you can't really take more bites. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Helen, what do you think of breakfast? It was good. Yeah, I had uh, Rick's adobo rice. Dolo, Lolo, Lolo Rick's uh, adobo fried rice. Uh, I was gonna take that. I got it there. <laughs> <laughs> but how was it? Did you like it? It was good. Yeah, it really tasted like adobo, and it was covered in an omelet. You know, and the hash browns. And yeah, it's good. I think the only thing that Heather wanted to do was he opened, he cut it at the wrong side because all the meat was on the other side. Yeah, <laughs> I, I first cut it in the left side where there was a lot more rice, a little bit of meat. Then when I got to the other end, there was all the meat. So. <laughs> but it's okay, he still ate it. And uh, I had the uh, loco moco, which is good. It just reminded me of Hawaii when I had it. So they had the patties and the egg and the rice and the gravy and just combination of flavors it was so so good and we also had the ube pancakes yeah very luscious did you like it Henry? i know and I, I, I had it took a bite but it was really good it makes me want to hate my life so much <laughs> it's very addicting but it is super super sweet yeah That's it was because so. they have what cream cheese on it yeah. uh, condensed milk as their syrup on yep. top yep. and a lot of like the ube sauce mm -hmm. uh, syrup <laughs> Everything uh, on it, man. It was just, it was just heavenly. <laughs> super sweet, though. Super sweet, but damn. I yeah. want more, but it's gonna kill me. <laughs> yeah. So, this one just opened like last year, right, Henry? Um, from what the waitress said, they opened up August yeah. last year. So. And then um, they do have several locations in the Vegas area. This is still off the strip. So if you plan to go to Las Vegas, it would be better if you go off the Strip to experience all the different types of food there. I mean, Vegas Strip has a lot of good options, but if you really want to experience everything, it's better to go outside. Yes. Right, Henry? Yep, definitely. <laughs> all right. So would you recommend this place, Henry? Oh, yeah. Yeah, something new, something different, and they got good pancakes and food. Yeah, and yeah. it got busy, so... Yeah, there was a lot more people. I mean, it is Saturday, so, you know, people are off, and it's breakfast time, so people must eat breakfast. So. Yeah, and Las Vegas people love breakfast, so mm -hmm. I, don't, I don't blame them. All right, Hunter, last words! Yes, please don't forget to comment, subscribe, and hit that bell button! Ding, 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 see you guys! Bye!